What are you doing? <laughs> Ready for a clean up extravaganza? surgery. Good morning. It is Saturday, so that means it's a family day, and it's actually a rainy, gloomy Saturday. So I'm not sure what we're going to do yet, but we'll find something to get into. It is like 7.30 a.m. Tiana's already up and about, as you can see. Um, ever since we got back from Switzerland, she's been a little bit of an early riser. So she's been getting up at like 5.30 or 6.30 because I think just getting used to the time change, but we're enjoying our little mornings together. Right, baby? <laughs> no. Oh no, we're not. <laughs> there you go. There you go. You want Daddy to get up? Uh, yeah. Okay, let's go get Daddy. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 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 um, ma'am, what are you doing? Okay, ma'am. <laughs> okay, ma'am. You only do this when mommy and daddy are around, okay? Okay. Come on. Gotcha. Come on. Go. <laughs> <laughs> you want to hear something funny? John's addicted to checking slick deals, but he never buys anything. Hey, you never know. It might be a deal. Are you having sprinkles on your toast? Huh? 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 You want? You want a couple? Uh -huh. Do you want a little couple of sprinkles? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's make some avocado toast. You ready? Avocado toast! Yay! Can I have some of my toast? Can you put uh -huh. some here? Oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> we relocated to do some damage control. You want to do your butter? Here. I thought we were doing just fine. Tiana, tell her we don't need any help. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh oh. Tiana doesn't like to have her hands dirty, but she likes to get her hands dirty, so it's a conundrum. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> eat it now? You can eat it now. Uh oh, there you go. Alright, take a big bite and see how it is. You wanna try mine? It's hailing really bad. Oh my gosh. John, come here. Look at this. Holy crap. What in the hell? <laughs> oh my gosh. We just finished breakfast and now I'm going downstairs to do a load of laundry and I realize you guys have never seen our downstairs so you're in for a treat. Just like when we moved in, we haven't really done anything down here except put our stuff for storage. Um, so it's just a hallway that leads to the garage right there and then the washer and dryer. The dryer's really loud right now. Our washer and dryer is really old but it still works so we're not going to get a new one at this point. Um, very functional area, not the prettiest, but this will be the last thing we redecorate because we're not down here a lot and nobody really sees it. Um, so Tiana was helping me make coffee and I turned around for a second and she poured the creamer for me, which was very helpful. Thank you, baby. How's it going? She's very focused. Oh, okay. Are you going to taste it? Huh? Are you gonna taste it? Ha ha, it's hot. I don't think it's, is it hot? I think it's probably not hot anymore after all that creamer. <laughs> it's good? Usually by now we would be outside at the park or something, but since it's hailing and raining, we're taking a rainy day bubble bath. Bubble bath, that is not Yeah. Bubble bath. So, I hate this, I so. 
So you notice like the black here on our tub and this hole in the wall because we had a big leak coming down from the shower. And we're actually gonna redo everything, rip it all out and create a stand up tiled shower and just redo this whole bathroom since we have to take everything down anyway, like the walls and stuff. We might as well just get it all done while we're at it. And I'm really excited about that, but it's gonna be quite the project. So I think we're gonna wait till after New Year's to do it. John Cam, I'm getting ready to go in here and play some basketball. Look, if you follow me on Instagram, you know I'm going through some injuries right now. I just had an MRI. I'm waiting on the results. But look, I can't use that as an excuse, you know. Look, it's not so much that I need the game, but the game needs me. Now, I'm not going to go in here and drop 50 or 60 on them like I normally would. I'll probably just put up a casual 30, a few windmill dunks or something like that. Just something real light. But look, they need me, man. And I got to go in here and I got to perform. I can't use these excuses. So, uh, yeah, here we go. All right, so I actually didn't get picked up in the first game, and that's because neither one of them thought it was fair to pick up the best player. So I'm currently sitting. I got a solid squad over here. We're next. Oh, and if you're wondering why they're sitting down here, and I'm sitting here, other than the guy over there with the white and black shirt that shot just shot the ball, he's somebody's dad. I'm older than everybody in here by about 10 years. So we don't have much in common to talk about, although I am the one vlogging, so there's some irony in that. Their most recent topics of conversation were GPA scores and Tinder dates. So I went ahead and downloaded Tinder just so we can have some common ground for small talk. We're gonna clean Tiana's room while Daddy's at basketball. Ready for a clean up extravaganza? Uh-huh. Yeah! Clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up, clean up! Wardrobe change! Is your room all clean? Uh-huh. We did such a good job, huh? Uh-huh, yeah. And now I'm going to take a shower finally. It's like almost 11.30 and I, we haven't gotten dressed yet, which I think is an accomplishment for a Saturday. But I'm gonna take a shower in her bathroom that's attached to her room and then keep her door shut so she can just play and I know she's up here uh -huh. with me. All right, so admittedly, I'm not very good at basketball anymore, at least not until I heal this ankle up, but I can still be a good husband and father and surprise them with snacks when they wake up from their nap. Who's up from their nap? Is Daddy home? <gasps> What's that? What did Daddy get you? What's that? Is that a yummy snack? A candy snack? Oh, thank you, babe. Yeah. All right, you think you can handle the sourness? What do you think? Oh, no face. <laughs> do you it... like it? Tiana and I took a two hour nap after we cleaned the room and I took a shower. And now I have put on some eyeliner because we are doing an outing to Target. Um, so it's still gloomy outside. I thought it was gonna clear up, but it didn't. We asked Tiana what she wants to do. And one of her favorite things to do is to go to Target and play with the toys in the toy aisle. So John and Tiana are already downstairs getting in the car because they can't wait any longer and I'm gonna go meet them down there and we're gonna go have a Target play date. What are you doing? She said it's not not drive. Where are we going? Are you there? Oh, over there. <laughs> Can you hawk the horn? Huh? Push right here. Not loud. It's too loud. <laughs> Her new favorite thing to do is to talk in a Donald Duck voice. <laughs> we ended up coming to Marshall's first because I need a tree for the living room. There's a big empty spot in the living room and I want a nice like cool green tree to go there. And I feel like it'd be cheaper at Marshall's than anywhere else, so. Stop number one. I didn't find a tree, but I found some other stuff. I didn't find a tree, but I found this stuff. And she's trying to fit in there. <laughs> hey, is this an Elsa art kit? Wow. It's already wow. falling apart, so maybe Daddy can get a discount on it. Thanks for pushing my stuff. She's too fast for me. She's on a mission. Oh, she's already doing it. 
We still haven't made it to Target, but we did make it to Home Goods. I thought I'd have better luck in here finding a tree, and there are a lot of trees, but nothing that really fits what I'm looking for. So I guess we will be heading to Target after this, but we're just kind of exploring. Tiana loves checking out the toy aisles. There's a lot of toys in here for her to play with. Could I have a banana, please? Thank you. Oh no, Nana. We finally made it to Target. Did anybody else's Target paint theirs brown? Or is it just here in West Virginia? <laughs> so we found her this Elsa doll, but she doesn't care. She just keeps doing this <laughs> over and over again. <laughs> Whoa, break it, you bought it. You guys, there's so many people in here. It's really busy and it's stressing John out. Sensory overload. Is there too many people in here for you? Are you sensory overloaded? <laughs> Very cute. He's sad? Let's see if he's sad. Are you ready? <gasps> he said he's happy. No, he's happy. No sad. Okay, he's sad. He's sad. <laughs> Okay, John and I decided Tiana's never played Nerf Wars and we haven't in a long time. So we're gonna buy some Nerf stuff. To <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have a Nerf gun war tonight. Bam! Whose team are you gonna be on, mommy or daddy? Daddy? Yeah! Hey! Daddy! Mommy. daddy. Mommy. No, you can't change your mind, you already said it. No, mommy. All right, fine. You and mommy versus me. I said mommy, I said Good job! Oh, wow! So this is how Nerf Wars is going so far. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> that was an John's accident. John's first shot was straight to my face. It was an accident on purpose. After <laughs> we just sat down and taught Tiana not to shoot people in the face, he shot me straight in the face. But honestly, it was a good shot. So now we're going to probably just shoot targets around the house. <laughs> Those things actually hurt. I didn't expect it to hurt. It really does hurt. Tiana is getting bored of darts already. She wants to play something else. But John and I are not bored yet. We are, um, I'm hiding in the kitchen and I'm trying to shoot him so he knows what it feels like. Look at that. Look at that. Stop. Ah, stop it. I want to shoot you. Say your final words. <laughs> 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 Who won, Daddy or Mommy? Mommy. Yeah! Every time. An afterthought, I was wondering if a Nerf War is uh, three and up appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not, but... Who, who did we really bomb for? She didn't really participate, so... Yeah, it's kind of just us. But it was a lot of fun. Ma'am? Hmm? Are you going to clean this up? This is what Tiana wanted to do with the Nerf supplies. I wanted to show you guys what I bought really fast. Everything was actually from Marshalls. I didn't find anything at Target or Home Goods, and I did not find the tree, the perfect tree to fit in that corner, but it's okay because I found a lot of cool stuff on the clearance rack. So first of all, I got this wooden bowl because I've been looking for one for the kitchen just to put like fruit and stuff in. Um, it matches kind of our theme. And then I got these mugs. We really, really needed coffee mugs. We don't have any, so we've been drinking coffee out of jars, but it's hard because they get hot. So just these white mugs to stack on the counter. These were only $8 for all four, which I think is really cheap. We just got some cups with lids to take to work and things like that. Um, a water bottle for John because his broke. And then I just got two candles that were on clearance because I am running low on candles. Um, and I didn't really care if they looked like they just smelled good. So that's how I chose them. Um, I spent about like $40 on all this stuff. But it is stuff I needed, kind of, I guess, arguably, definitely needed the water bottle um, and probably could survive without the rest, but it's stuff I've been wanting, so I just went ahead and got it. I'm currently shopping for a coffee maker because we've been drinking instant coffee for years and we're starting to like coffee a lot more lately, so we wanted to have some good coffee and be able to make it at home. So we want to set up like a little coffee bar, which is why I was excited to get these cute mugs to go with it. But um, if you guys have any coffee maker recommendations, 
recommendations, let me know below. So far I've seen Keurig and Nespresso seem to be the most popular. We're not looking for anything like super fancy, but we would like to be able to make iced coffee and hot coffee, maybe lattes. So let me know what you recommend below because we really have no idea what we're looking for. We're gonna try to get it on Black Friday so we can get a good deal. All right, so far so <laughs> That freaking rabbit is still in the bed. Rabbits don't go in the bed. They, oh no. All right. And the next bears don't sit in chairs. Are they silly? We ate dinner, watched a movie. Um, the getting dark early thing is really killing our vibe because we like to go outside after dinner, but it's dark and cold. So we watched a movie instead. And now we're in Tiana's room playing and reading and winding down because what? it's just about her bedtime. And we try to come up here maybe like 15 or 20 minutes before her bedtime play with her toys in her room and read some books so that she doesn't just like come up here to go straight to bed. Hey, and um, I think it really helps her wind down. This is our favorite book, or my personal favorite, the LeBron James book, I Promise. Hey, John's reading the book by himself. I am. I promise to be open and try new things and enjoy, and enjoy the happy thing. <laughs> <laughs> Can you say, good night everybody. Good night. <laughs> You ready for bed? No. Can you, can you say, see you in the morning? It's the morning. We love you. Hey. Mm. She wants me to kiss you. Can I have a kiss? No. Mm. <laughs> Are you making mommy and daddy kiss? Okay. Thanks, baby. <laughs> oh, God. Tiana's asleep now. It is around 9 o'clock. So now is usually when like John and I hang out, finish up anything that we need to do during the day, and then watch like Netflix or YouTube videos. Yeah, we're currently watching Squid Game combined with uh, you. Yeah. And uh, trying to figure out which one we want to watch that night, but anyway. It's a very calming mixture of shows to watch before yeah. bed. <laughs> but we wanted to talk to you guys about um, Tiana's upcoming surgery, which we posted on Instagram, but we wanted to talk to you guys about it here because a lot of people had questions. So we just found out the other day after we went and saw an ear, nose, and throat specialist that Tiana will need a tonsillectomy and adenoidectomy because her tonsils and tissue in her throat is very enlarged. I hate that she has to go into surgery because she, she is so active and hates sitting still. And I think the doctor said like almost two weeks, it could be up to two weeks that she kind of has to relax. Two, he said two weeks, she has to be at home on like house rest basically. So I'm getting a lot of mixed like reviews from that or mixed uh, feedback is that some people's kids were fine the same day and some like didn't really get the worst of it until seven or nine days in. Mm -hmm. And so if you have any kids or you've been through it yourself, let us know down in the comment section uh, about what we should expect for recovery time and what we can expect. Uh, but I just feel so bad for baby girl. I know, I feel really bad, but she snores and has like obstructive sleep apnea just from her tonsils because there's no other issues causing it. So I think this is definitely gonna help her in the long run. And they're so big that sometimes when she's eating, like causes her to gag on food. Um, and she mouth breathes, like it's just uncomfortable for her. But um, I know I picked the ENT. It's somebody I've worked with a lot before. Um, his wife's an anesthesiologist where I work. And also I know all the CRNAs at the pediatric hospital where she'll be getting her surgery. So I know she's in great hands. We just don't want to see her in pain after the surgery. I think she'll bounce back really quick. She's like very energetic and everything. But I, I think our biggest challenge is going to be getting her to stay still for healing. Oh, absolutely. I guess that's what I was saying. She does not like to sit still, but we're going to make sure she has all the best ice cream, all the good ice, the good ice from the hospital, and popsicles and smoothies, and make sure she recovers well. And uh, yeah, I just uh, it just sucks that she has to go through something like this. I mean, it's not, I guess it's not the biggest thing. No, I'm sure kids do yeah. it all the time, so I don't want to make too much of a dramatization of it, but it just... You know, it is sad, it's our daughter. Yeah, we're thankful she's healthy and this is just a minor issue. That's all kind of we had to chat with you guys about at the end of the vlog. Um, thanks for hanging out with us today. I hope that you found it interesting or enjoyable to watch. It was yeah. just kind of a normal day. It was a good family day. Yeah. Uh, we, she loves going to the store and playing with all the toys and uh, she wore herself out, so she's dead asleep now. And yeah. Like you, you said, we're gonna try to relax a little bit, maybe watch a show or two. Edit, you're gonna edit this vlog. Yeah. And uh, and then we'll see you guys next week. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Bye. I gotta do my thing.